Hi everyone, Gerdy Verwoerd here, their Great League Guiding Coach. And today is episode 7 of the series about how to hike the mountains safely. Paco, ga je mee? Kom maar. Kim, come on. Good boy. So, how to hike the mountains safely. Uh, tip 7. Bring a first aid kit. And a first aid kit in your backpack is something like the first aid kit in your car. You're likely to never use it other than for uh, plasters and maybe getting a splinter out of your finger. But you're going to regret it when you don't have it with you. So, um, well again, make sure there's a first aid kit in your backpack. And also, like the first aid kit in your car, every now and again, check it for uh, the supplies that are in there and the expiration date that is on them. Um, especially, Paco, especially things like um, sterile, that are sterile, have expiration dates on them and you are expected to replace them when that date has come and gone. Now, um, also important is to know how to use whatever is in that first aid kit. So when you go to the outdoor store or to the drug store and get one of those uh, tailored kits that you can get there that are tailored to hiking, um, don't just buy it, don't even take the wrapping off and put it in your backpack without knowing what's in there and without knowing what, how to use it. And also, uh, I know I do that, I look at what's in there and I may add a couple of things. I always add finger plasters, plasters specifically designed to put on your finger. They have longer sticky bits so it's easier to put a plaster on your finger and keep it there, not lose it somewhere along the way. And uh, Morgan. Morgan. And also um, what I always put in there is uh, blister plasters, plasters specifically designed to put on blisters. Uh, they've got, you've got brands like Compede and Second Skin that are really, really good and a lot better usually than the generic brand. So with um, plasters for blisters, I, I tend to stick with the original brand. But the most important thing is that you know how to use it, you, how to use anything that's in there, because it's no use uh, when you get to an emergency or when you yourself are in an emergency and you have to figure out uh, how to apply whatever is in there, how to, uh, how to use certain things, how to put pressure on wounds, how to apply CPR, which is not in the, uh, in the kit itself, but there's probably a booklet in there that tells you how to do it. So those are all things that are really good for you to know how to use. Morgen. Hi, Michi. Um, so, know how to use your first aid kit and have it with you. Check it regularly for expiration dates to come and go. And should you be in the mountains and should you open your first aid kit and find that whatever sterile dressing that you want to apply to a wound of your own or of somebody else, and it says the date has come and gone. Who cares? Use what you've got. You know, in that instance, don't worry about the fact that the expiration date has gone. It's better than putting nothing on that wound. So, when you go into the mountains, bring a first aid kit. And not only that, know how to use it. As always, go there greatly. And I'll be talking to you soon. Bye bye.